What's up guys? Today we're going to do an oil change on the Honda CM400E. Alright, let's get started. So basically what you want to do is get your bike in an upright position and uh, get yourself an oil pan, something to catch all that oil in. Next you want to get yourself a 17 millimeter socket. Uh, that way you can pull the oil plug and uh, get all that oil out of there. Okay at this point you can go ahead and pop out your dipstick and let the remaining uh, oil drain. While the oil is draining, let's go ahead and get a 12 millimeter socket and let's get that oil filter out of there. Next, you want to replace the uh, filter cover O-ring uh, with a new one. Uh, those old ones kind of get flat and wore out, so you want to replace that with a um, a new new O-ring. I like to take the new O-ring and rub a little bit of oil on the uh, the new O-ring. Uh, don't forget to replace your oil filter bolt o-ring um, just apply a little bit of oil and uh, that should help it uh, go on pretty good all right it's time to put the oil filter back in um, get you a new oil filter slide that back in place um, the oil filter bolt uh, uses a 12 millimeter socket and that needs to be torqued down to about 20 to 23 foot pounds. And last but not least, um, need to reinstall the um, drain plug. And that needs to be tightened down um, using the 7 millimeter socket uh, to about 18 to 25 foot pounds. Alright, now it's time to, to add the oil. Um, I'm using the Vaveline 20W50 uh, today. Um, and this, this bike takes about 2.6 quarts. Alright, last but not least, I want to double check and make sure that we've got the proper amount of oil. Uh, don't screw the uh, cap in when you're making this check, just rest it at the top. Um, when you're done, screw it in and you're ready to crank it up. 